find anybody. Oh, no. What do we do? Mop was with me, but... I can't do this alone. You should try to find them. We know where we're supposed to be. We just need to get there. Look! The walkers are still moving toward the harbor. We can make it out if we stick to... Everything all right? No, I'm not all right. But I'll be a lot better once we get with the others. I need to make sure everyone else made it out. Luke, Sarah, Kenny. God damn it. What if they aren't there? If they aren't, nothing we can do about it. Don't even say things like that. Fine. Sorry. Jesus. I don't even know if we're safe. What if the herd is still following us? We're fine. It's been quiet, but who knows? It's been at least an hour since I saw any walkers. Carver's people should be keeping them busy for a while. That'd be lucky. I know I should feel glad that we escaped, but I just can't stop thinking about the others. How could I leave Alvin behind? It was stupid. What was? Escaping? Look, I know we all agreed to use the herd to get out, but maybe we should have been more patient. 
come up with something better. It worked. If you can call that working, we could have... I don't know. The plan worked. We got out of there. Most of us. Look, I know that some of your people didn't make it, but Carver was crazy. Staying would have only prolonged the inevitable. I'm just saying that if people hadn't panicked, things might have turned out better. Of course. We panicked. We were scared. The plan was good. The execution was the messy part. That sounds an awful lot like you're saying it was their fault. What? No. No, that's not what I'm saying. Just... I have to stop. I'm sorry. I don't want to slow us down. Can I just have a minute? Uh, yeah. Take a minute. Thank you. <laughs> Alvin was supposed to be here for this. Is Alvin... He's dead is what he is. Thanks to that fucking madman back there. Kenny might know what to do. He had a family. Let's hope he made it to the meetup point then. What are you going to do with it? What do you mean by that? Uh, sorry. Just making conversation. There was nothing. No. What do you mean by that? Do with what? My baby? I'm just looking at the worst case scenario. You and Clem won't be able to raise a baby by yourselves. Not out here. I just mean it's going to need food and, you know, other stuff. We can't just abandon it. Hey, whoa. I never said you should abandon it. I just mean that sometimes you can't protect everyone you'd want to. And you assume I won't be capable enough. Just because you're some angry loner who doesn't care about anyone but herself doesn't mean you know better than me. Hey, I've seen it before. Back when it started, me and my sister, we what? were... She died? I don't need your pity. You don't... You don't have the right... Jane! Shit, I didn't mean to... Shit. Jane, wait. Oh, damn it. We can't just sit here doing nothing. I know, I know. They'll be here soon. Holy shit. It had been so long, we were starting to worry no one else would make it. Well, besides... How's Sarita? I tried to talk to Ken. He flipped out on me. He started yelling. Scary shit. I know. He probably didn't mean it. But it was scary. I hate to say it. Sarita's on her way out. She's probably gonna turn soon. Is, uh... Is he gonna take care of her? Jane! I know it's not pretty, but it's better than the alternative. Just let me talk to him first. It's all right, Sarita. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna be here with you. Right till the end. Hi, Kenny. You think I don't know what y'all are whispering about over there? I said we just wanted a little fucking time alone to say goodbye. <laughs> shh, shh, shh. It's okay, babe. It's okay. We're gonna get through this. We're gonna do what we gotta do. We're gonna play the shit hand that this shit world dealt us. Kenny, I'm so sorry about Sarita. You hear that, babe? Clem says she's sorry. Don't that make you feel better? <laughs> Why are you acting this way? Take one wild guess, Clementine. I tried to save look her. Look at her. I said, look at her. She is going to die. Because of you. Uh, 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 uh. You think because...
because you're a little girl, you can just get people killed and no one will care. That because you're sorry, it'll all magically go away? That's not how it works! Now for the last time, just leave us alone to say goodbye. I'm going crazy just sitting here not doing anything. Just give it time, Mike. It's still early. Clem, how'd it go? Kenny's really mad at me. Clem, you can't just expect him to bounce back. That man's going through. At least you try. Still. Doesn't exactly help us figure out what we're gonna do now. We got no food, no water, it's getting damn cold, and we're losing daylight fast. When the others get back, they'll know what to do. Luke will have a plan. We thought Kenny would have a plan. Mike, Bonnie. <sighs> Mike's got a point. You can't just keep sitting around waiting. Things are difficult enough right now, and soon you'll have a baby on your hands too. What, suddenly you're pretending to be concerned? We should go find Luke and Sarah. If they're in trouble, we might be able to help them. Clementine's right. After everything, after all this, if there's any chance they're still alive, we need to take it. I'll go. Clem can come with me. Thank you. Listen, Rebecca, if anything goes wrong here, you got something to protect yourself? I've got this. You don't think I'd need to... I don't know, but you better keep that close. Come on, Clem. Look. You should know that finding your friends, that's a shot in the dark. Well, then why'd we come out here? I wanted to talk to you, away from them. You wouldn't have made it this far if you weren't smart. But I still... I just gotta warn you. That group is cracking. I've seen it before. And, well, a lot of times, it's better to be on your own. I know you see what I'm talking about. You don't want to be here when they start turning on each other. You know, bad stuff happens to you when you're alone, too. But your odds are better. There's nobody to watch your back. And when something does happen, there's nobody there to help you. How much help is Kenny going to be? What he's going through? He's more of a liability than anything. And Rebecca's situation is not making things better back there. You get enough broken people together, and all you're going to get are broken decisions. Have you just kept to yourself this whole time? Of course not. But sometimes you got to learn the hard way. I'm trying to save you that trouble. For what it's worth, I like most of the people in your crew. 
But groups fall apart. People get killed. Then why did you bring me with you? I'm just trying to give you the tools you need to make it. Like your jacket. It looks warm, but a walker will bite right through that. My sister Jamie had a good leather one. Wish I still had it. You could've. What... what happened to your sister? <laughs> Seems we always want to talk about the end, don't we? You know, being a big sister is... well... it's funny. It's really easy to be mean. Oh? You know, hide her toys, make fun of her bad haircut, give her the bad haircut on purpose. I mean, I did put the gum there. I figured I should get it out. Is that really what it's like having a sister? No, no. It's not all bad, but... What could I do? She thought I was her best friend. I couldn't go unpunished. <laughs> Every summer we'd go to this amusement park in Virginia. But the best part wasn't the rides. It was that nobody knew us there. And I'd... I'd pretend we weren't sisters. Just friends. <clears throat> All right, jackpot. Bet these walkers got some good stuff. Yeah, we should check them out. But you know why, right? Only because they're fresh. Take a look. Old walkers are a waste of time. They're holding credit cards and busted old pagers. But these ones weren't walkers all that long ago. They were survivors. They might have useful stuff. That one's not coming back. See what else he's got. I'll check this one. Hold on to him. Ammo's getting hard to come by, and things aren't going to get better. Find anything? Driver's licenses. Two of them. Well, I guess some people just can't leave the past behind. smart haircut thanks so has your crew always been so dysfunctional you fit in there but you weren't like them I was with a different group before that one worked better I think that was when I got my haircut like this that's it a nail file these things are great Sharpen a blade, strike a flint. Jamie always had one in her purse. I'd jab my hand when I went reaching in. <sighs> Can never be too sure with these things. Here, give me a hand. Sarah's. Looks like your friend didn't make it. Sorry. I don't know what to tell you. All we know is that she was here. It could be a good sign. Don't go getting your hopes up. Look, Clem, I know what you want me to say, but... Get off! Sarah! Goddamn! Shit! Okay, come on. We gotta find a way in. Looks like there's an opening over there. Look, we're gonna go do this, but it might not turn out the way you want it to. 
Are you prepared for what you might find in there? I think I am. Yes. I hope so. They might not be dead, but that might be worse. That hatchet of yours seems to get stuck pretty easily. It's gonna get you killed. Here, use this. Very effective. We can do this. They don't sound too good. Clock is ticking. I'm ready. I know you are. We need to get a better look. Not like this. You can't do this. How about you get the close one and I'll hop the fence to get the other? Go for it. you're doing. Now watch this. You've got a nice little addition to your arsenal. I can't! I can't! I can't! I can't! Take out the knees first. Then, put a knife in the back of its head when it's down. Alright, let's get a look at what we've got on deck. Snap out of it! Glad you're paying attention. No, I'm not. I, I can't. No. Let's what see if we doing? can find anything Why over there. Doing it? Yeah, most oh, of these wait. guys are gonna have nothing on them, but it's worth taking a look when it's not too risky. Wait, we don't want to make any noise until we've dealt with those guys. Come on! The knee thing. Nice <laughs> trick. a lot of walkers. They look worked up about something. And what gets the interest yeah. of the dead? People. How do we get in? If we can make enough noise on this side, we can lure those walkers over here. Then we might just be able to go through that other what trailer and get to your friends. To what do you think of that? I mean, I'm just making it up as I go along. Let's make some noise. Right. What's going to grab their attention? No! I got you covered. <laughs> Damn it, don't do this. That's good, but we need to keep it going somehow. What are you thinking? I can't help you if you... I 
If we lean him on the horn, it'll keep honking and draw the walkers. Just like moths to a flame. Give me a hand. What the hell? We can't stay here. Come on. Crap. We gotta move it. It's locked. Then try something else. You're gonna need to use more force than that. Put some muscle into it. I'll hold them off. Just get us in there. Help me block this! Hurry! Sarah, please. Who's out there? Luke! Clem? Oh, thank God. I can't believe he found us. When I heard y'all banging through the door... We gotta get moving. I'll second that. Well, I would've left already, but I... I got Sarah here, and... I... I don't know what to do about her. What's the matter? You gotta help. Sarah, look. Look, it's Clown. See, it's just like I told you. That they're okay. Sarah, come on. We... we have to go now. Come on! We need to get out of here. Guys, we can't do this. We can't... we can't... we can't stay here! I don't know what to do. I can't snap her out of it. Okay, I tried to carry her, but I... I guess Carver messed me up pretty good back there. I don't know, it was just after Carlos, she just lost it. Started running through the woods like a maniac. I, I chased her for I don't know how long, and then... while well, she saw this mobile home made a beeline right for her. I'm just glad y'all are here. We're not out of the woods yet. What are we gonna do about her? We gotta do something. Maybe she'll listen to me. Maybe. Listen, I, uh... They're gonna tear this place open pretty soon. We can't stay. So, we, we gotta get her up, or, or we gotta... Well, I've been trying. I've been trying for hours. I can barely get her to look at me. Clem? It's me. Hi. I need you to listen to me, okay? It's important. I know how you feel right now. It's one of the worst feelings in the world. Ever since the walkers, so many people I know have died. People I love. And for stupid reasons. Crap, we're surrounded. What? What about the skylight? All we got. Clem, there's no time. Clem. Listen, Jane might be right. We can't be kids anymore, sir. You need to grow up, or you'll die. There aren't any other choices. Get to the skylight! Now! Come on, I'll boost you! What's going on back there? My ribs. 
We're gonna need something to stand on. Luke, get over here. Help me hold this. Clem, see what you can find. Can we use this? Yeah, that would work. What? Oh, shit. Okay, ready? On three. One, two, three! We need you up top. Uh, ah, ah, okay, come on! Clem! Sarah, we have to go! Are you listening? Now, Clementine! If she doesn't want to go, you can't make her! Don't let her take you down, too. Not again. Nothing we could do. Come on. Sarah, I, uh, I didn't think you'd leave her. It's hard to think about. You left her, too. I know. I know. It may be hard to hear, but you weren't going to be able to save her. She was never going to make it in this world. Yeah, I guess... I guess there was just nothing we could do. I tried so hard to get through to her. What happened in there? When we went in there, you were ready to help, but then something changed. Look, I just... I'd seen that kind of thing before. I just didn't want to stick around for the bitter end. Sorry, I... I don't mean to sound harsh. It's okay, I get it. Things aren't always simple. Trust me. I tried to save Jamie, too, but she gave up. And when you really look at it, maybe it's better this way. For everyone. We were there for hours. You know, I should have gotten through to her. I should have done something. All I did was leave her behind. Luke, you can't let it eat away at you. Well, I can't forget it. I dragged my sister across four states. And every morning, she'd say she wasn't getting up. So I'd convince her. Or push her. Or goddamn carry her if I had to. Until this time... Walkers cornered us. Forced us up to the roof. And, and when they kept coming, I... I couldn't make her jump. Couldn't throw her. So I tried something else. I told her she could have what she wanted, and I left her there. Jumped to the next building over by myself, 
You left your sister? Jane, I'm really sorry. It killed me for a long time. But I finally realized that I'd put her on a forced march through hell, when all she really wanted was for me to let her go. Sarah was that way, too. Jane? No regard for her own safety. Or ours. Sarah wasn't dangerous to anybody. Come on, let's get back to your friends. Son of a bitch. You found him? Yeah, I'm a little amazed myself, to tell you the truth. If it weren't for Clem and Jane, well, I don't know what would have happened. Wait, where's Sarah? <sighs> uh, Rebecca, how about we, uh, we go for a walk for a minute? Let's just give him some space. I have something I need to talk to you about, too. No! No! <laughs> I ain't gonna sugarcoat this. That baby's coming even faster than Rebecca's letting on. But I was hoping you might know, does Luke know anything about babies? Has he, I don't know, mentioned Carlos teaching him anything? No, I don't think so. I was afraid of that. I don't know anything. Mike sure as hell doesn't. I don't even know how to ask Jane. And that just leaves... Kenny. He brought Sarita in there not long after you left. I don't know if he's done it yet. I ain't seen him since. I don't think he's doing well. We need to get him to come out. I agree, but with the way he's acting, I don't know if we should be ganging up on him. I think if it's just you, someone he knows well, you might be able to get through to him. We need your help, with Rebecca's baby. No one else knows what to do. She didn't want me to wait, but I had to. In case by some crazy chance, she didn't come back. I'm sorry, Kenny. You know what it feels like to get beaten almost to death. Peaceful. It feels peaceful. It was like I was floating away, watching the whole thing happen to me. And then I woke up again, and nothing's changed. I'm still taking a beating. Every day. 
Duck, Katya, Sarita. No peace, no rest. The punches just keep coming. Why the hell could Carver have just finished me off? Obviously, I ain't helping anyone by being here. That baby's almost here, and Rebecca needs your help. Yeah, I guess she does. Now, nah, don't worry yourself about this. It's nothing. Hadn't killed me yet, anyway. Don't be stupid. It could be infected. Well? Oh, shit. Does that mean what I think it does? What are we supposed to do? We should see what's going on. Are you okay? How does it feel? It feels wet. That's how it feels. What's going on? Rebecca's water broke. Mm. Oh, Christ. We should... I don't know what we should do. Oh, fuck. That means the baby's coming, right? Kenny, thank God. I think the baby's coming. What do we do? All right, all right. Give me a second. No way can Rebecca trap her like this. He's right. She's gonna make a lot of noise. They'll be able to smell her, too. Now you got no choice but to lock down and ride it out. What kind of stuff do babies need when they're being born? Kenny, come on, you gotta focus. Right, right, sorry. Clean water for one thing, and blankets. And we gotta get out of this damn cold, too. That map shows a couple of buildings nearby. Maybe one of them could do the trick. The museum seems like it could be a good start. I'll go. Good idea. Mike, think you could go with her? Sure thing. I'll check the building by the river. Okay, then. Kenny, you, uh, you stick with Rebecca, and I will check the perimeter for walkers. Clem... I know it must have been hard, but thank you for talking to Kenny. I'd love for you to give me and Mike a hand looking at the museum, but I was thinking... How do we know Jane ain't just gonna take off? Maybe you should go with her. Make sure she comes back. What do you mean by that? You know, she doesn't seem to like being around people much. And she volunteered to head off awful fast. I guess it could be nothing. I trust Jane. Yeah. I mean, I would've never made it back without her. Just something to think about. Okay, we're looking for warm blankets, clean water, disinfectant. That all sound right? Don't worry. Everything's gonna be fine. I can stay here and help. Kenny and I got that covered. And you'll be more help scouting with the others. You wanna come with us? Okay. All right, everyone, you know what to do. Let's be fast, and let's be careful. I guess that's the place there. Fuck. It's a wreck. You ain't even been inside yet. Just look at it. Glass all blown out, walkers hanging around. Stop being so cranky. <sighs> Sorry. I just really want sticking with y'all to work out. And it's been hard so far. How about you make it up to us by helping out with those walkers up there? Yeah, all right. Jane showed me a good way to attack them. If you take out a knee, they always fall. And then you can stab them in the back of the neck. Hmm. A good smack to the head's always that fine for me.
So the knee is about halfway down the leg. Yeah, okay. Let's do this before more of them show up. Watch out for the broken glass. It's all over. Okay. Somebody's already been through here. Guess that's not a surprise. Still, might be something worthwhile left. Let's check it out. I hope whoever it was left already. We'll be fast. Let's just take a sweep. I really don't want to go back empty-handed. Keep one eye on the woods while we're in here. I don't want nothing sneaking up on us. I'll watch this side, you watch the other. Deal. Souvenirs, huh? Looking for a keychain with your name on it? No. Why would I want a keychain? I don't even have any keys. Ah, oh, good point. You think maybe they say that stuff about water and blankets just to get people out of the way? Oh, you don't know what the hell you're talking about. And you didn't have to come with me. Empty. No, I wanted to. Never mind. There have sure been some animals through here. Watch where you step. Any luck? No, not so much. Do you think these work? Nah, they're just for show. Be handy, though. Also really loud. Good point. Hey, look at this. An old coat. Nice. Good find, Clem. You should hang on to that. It's gonna get a lot colder before it starts getting warmer. Kenny said we need blankets. It's not really a blanket, but... But it should do the trick. Good call. I guess you've already got that old coat I gave you. I feel so bad about everything that happened. Hopefully you won't always think of me like that. Not that I blame you if you did. I haven't always used the best judgment. It seems like you're with us now. That's what matters most. Clem found a jacket. That's great, but uh, isn't Gray the, you know, uh... We can't put Rebecca in a Confederate coat. Oh, I didn't even think about that. Guess it's better than nothing, though. I tell you, I sure don't like being... Graveyard with the world the way place. it is now. The way things are now, you're in a graveyard all the time. Yeah, true enough. Nothing but junk in there. Trust me. Over here. Water! Bottled and clean. That's just what we need. It's locked. You want to kick it down? That'd make an awful lot of noise. Yeah, maybe. You know, if somebody was small enough, they could maybe squeeze through that gap there. I could try to pry it open some more, but I don't know if that'll help much. No, I mean, maybe... All right, all right. I'll go. Thanks, Clem. Just open the door from the other side. Mike will carry those things out. Might be a bit heavy for you. Uh, 
I'm stuck. Okay, maybe I push from... Well, that happened. Thanks, Mike. Yeah, no problem. I'm so sorry about that, Clementine. We should have been more careful. At least now we got something to bring back. I'll keep checking the other room. Let's get this water. Hey, I got this. That looks pretty heavy. Uh, it's all right. I know it looks like a lot, but we could all go through this pretty quick. Carver was crazy, but at least his shelves were always full. We're gonna have to be conservative as hell. You're right. I thought it looked like so much. That baby's gonna be hard on everyone, especially Rebecca. And between you and me, she's not looking too good. Hey, guys! Come on, stick close. I just walked on in like it owned the place. Figure it'd make a nice meal. We can eat raccoon? I need the shit out of that raccoon. Not like... I mean, just, just that I'd be really happy to eat that raccoon. I'm starving. Fresh meat would go a long way with Rebecca. Yeah. Shoot! Don't let it get away! Where is it? I think it went over there. There he is! He's coming your way! Block him! Oh! Oh, shit! Shoot! Dang it! Not with the walkers out there. I'm even hungrier than I was before. How'd I get to a place where I'm sad I'm not eating raccoon? Well... I'm sort of glad it got away. It had a family. Yeah, me too. Come on, let's just get this back to Rebecca and the others. We don't have much time to waste. I'm not supposed to be in labor yet, Kenny. What if something's wrong? Nothing's wrong. Babies know how to be born. How long did your son take? How you doing, Beck? Okay. I'm okay. How did you guys make Museum's out? Museum's a bust. All glass walls shattered. It'd be impossible. And it was picked over pretty good. Lots of folks probably been there before us. We found some water, though. Oh, that's good. Nice work. Good. Good. We save all of that for Rebecca. Anybody else gets a thirst, you can go to the river. Glad you made it back safe. How are you feeling? Scared. And it hurts. <laughs> I wish Alvin was here. Everything Alvin did was for you and the baby. Back at Carver's. In the office. He stayed behind to stop the people chasing us. He died to keep us safe. Jesus. Of course. Of course he did. I know it's a waste of time, 
But I can't stop thinking about things I should have said to him. Things I should have talked to him about. How am I ever going to do this without him? You're going to be a good mom. We sure have come a long way since we first met, huh? You're a... <sighs> oh, shit. I got this. I'm worried that we ain't seen Jane in a while. Go check on her, would you? Yeah, go on ahead. I'll be fine. Are you okay, Kenny? Sure. Why wouldn't I be? One of these buildings is safer than out here. This looks like where we are right now. I hope Jane finds something good over there. It looks closer on the map. Clementine, up here. Oh, hey. Museum was a bust, huh? We found water. A lot of it. Well, that's something, at least. Check this out. A skate's still locked. Which means that hopefully no one's gotten to whatever was locked in there in the first place. I've been trying to get it open, but it's locked pretty tight. Can't see what's inside. Do you think you can pick the lock? I should be able to figure something out. Maybe this will work. The nail file? Versatility is not overrated. You know, uh, it wouldn't hurt to try a heavier hand at this thing. See if you can find something bigger. We might need to bust the mechanism. There were more cannons in the museum. Mike said they're just for show. They fill them with cement, so they're safe. Oh. I guess it's broken. Find anything? No, not even trash.
There's some buildings across the river. I think I can see a church. The nearest river crossing is miles up. Rebecca wouldn't make it in her condition. Keep it in mind, though. Jane, there's someone coming toward us. Shit, shit, shit. He's coming this way. And who knows if he has friends nearby. I don't like having some stranger sneaking around. Why is he coming up here? No idea. But we should scope him out and see what he's up to. I don't like having some stranger sneaking around so close to the others. We've got enough on our plates with a baby coming. Last thing we need is someone telling their friends about the new easy targets in the neighborhood. Maybe I can try talking to him. Good call. Shit. Hide now. I'm just a kid. Please, don't hurt me. Do you understand me? Yes. I am Arvo. I'm going to go. I don't want to shoot. I don't want to shoot anyone. Especially Malinka Devochka. Uh, little girl. You don't have to shoot anyone. Just put the gun down. <gasps> Back up. Put the bag down. Clem, make sure he doesn't have any other weapons in there. No, I have no more guns! I... Anything? Whoa. That's a serious stash of meds. No, 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 no! Take whatever you want, but don't take the medicine. It's for my sister. My older sister, she's sick. The pain makes her cry, and that makes those things come. Please! If that medicine's for your sister, why are you hiding it in the garbage? I, uh... I need to keep it... I need to keep it safe. Sister or not, we could really use that stuff. No! You are not nice people! You have already left me defenseless, and now you... You take my sister's medicine? You are worry! Hey! We've got people who are suffering. Who need this medicine? Luke's still a wreck after Carver's. Kenny's a mess. Rebecca's in pain. Look at all of it! Clementine, we need people that stuff! People are suffering just as much as yours. You are not special! You're not taking them. I'm not robbing anybody. Just let him go. Oh, Bursa. Thank you, Clementine. Thank you. <laughs> oh, what are you doing? You don't have to do this. Just let me go. Jane, don't do it. Don't you ever come around here again. I don't care if you do have some sick sister. The next time I see you, you won't just be walking away. Go. Can't believe I've gotten into this mess. Threatening some stupid kid? I thought we were just gonna talk to him. I needed to make sure he didn't come back here again. Go get the others. I'm gonna get this place opened. Then we need to get moved in ASAP.
Clem! Clem, hey! Any luck with that observation, Dick? I was just checking on Rebecca and Kenny. They said they hadn't heard from me in a while. I don't guess there'd be much, but Jane seems pretty resourceful. God knows we could use a break. Shouldn't you be with Rebecca? No, no. Kenny's way more help with Rebecca than I could be. I'm just making sure we keep track of where everyone is. Is Jane still up there now? Yeah. She's trying to get the gift shop opened. You know, I can't figure her out. I mean, she really lays it on the line, but at the same time, she doesn't show you anything that counts. I'm still not sure what to think about her. She's strong, and she's been helping us, but she's cold. Maybe. But nobody's that cold. I'm definitely starting to think we might need to branch out. What do you mean? Jane seems like the kind of person who gets tempered by hardship, you know? But when I look at Kenny now, he just... he seems broken. And broken people get reckless. I know you got a history with him. Look, I think he's a good guy. At least started as a good guy. You're wrong. Kenny's stronger than anyone. He tries to protect us. I don't know, Clem. I know he's your friend and all. But what Kenny did to Carver, it sounded like he beat right through the corpse and into the floor. Is that where we are now? What would you have done if it was you? Well, I don't know. Really, I don't. I just think... less. I need to tell the others about the deck. Yeah, good. I will, uh... I'll see you back there. Told you. Okay, 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 okay. Oh God. Oh God. Oh. Shit, walkers. How'd they get that close without anyone seeing them? That was Luke. Kenny, we've got to do something. You just keep that baby safe. Kenny, we can't stay here. Museum. It's our only choice. No, Jane and I found a place. I'll show you. Good. Someone help me up. Oh, God. There's so many. Mike, the water. On it. Protect us. Sure, but... Uh... Kenny! I've felt in a long time. I almost forgot what... Clementine! J Jesus, Clem, it's just not... Um... What's going on? Well, uh... I mean... In here. Let's get you comfortable. What the fuck are you two doing up here? Kenny, what's going on? We got God knows how many walkers out there, which you were supposed to be keeping an eye out for. Hey, hold on a second. Just tell me what's going on. What's going on is you're a reckless fucking moron. I'm reckless. You know, you got a lot of nerve, Kenny. The walkers are right behind us. We have to keep them from getting up here. There's still the stairs. No! Fuck. I'm sorry. Shit. Right over Shit. here. Uh. They're coming up the stairs. Here. Uh, we should. You want to help. Get out there and keep the walkers off us. I'll do this. 
been here before. They can't rush us on the stairs. Shoot them before they get to us. Well, what do I do? Whatever you can, Clem. I'm staying with you. Fine, fine. Help her relax. Everything's gonna be all right. Just try to calm down. Stop telling me to be calm. You can trust Kenny. He won't let anything happen to your baby. You can do this. Clem, just make it stop. Please. This baby is coming, like it or not. <laughs> you can do this. You've gone through too much to give up now. Okay, okay. Uh, I, I, oh, I can talk. Just don't let go. Good, good. Clem, you need to get out there and help the others. I've got this. Keep shooting! They are not getting up here! We're gonna run out of ammo! Up to the block this gate. Help us! We can block the gate with this. I'll help. I'm coming. Together. Ready? Oh shit! Holy fuck! What the fuck is going on out there? Get up here! Fuck! Does this shit ever end? With that many walkers, will the deck break the rest of the way? I don't know. But, hey, maybe we can do it first. Drop the deck? Drop the... Are you fucking crazy? How are we gonna do that? I don't know, just look around. That'll work. We bust that, the whole thing comes down. Lose me. They're getting closer. Clementine! Move it! Come on! I'm going as fast as I can. Watch it! Son of a bitch! Hey, Clementine. Hey. How's he doing? He's perfect. Who's a perfect little man? Who's the most perfect little man in the whole world? He looks like Alvin. You think so? Definitely. Thank you. <coughs> I'm fine. I'm fine. I just wish I could get warm. Clem, why don't you give her that coat we found? Sorry, you know, about the color. You really think I care about that? Do you want to hold him? I don't know how. It's easy. Just keep him close and support his head. Go. You're a 
natural. Look at you, like a big sister. <coughs> Here, let me take him. You both should rest. Especially you. When's the last time you slept, Kenny? Oh, about two years ago. I'm fine. Plus, somebody's gotta watch you while Mama gets her beauty sleep. You never forget that smell. Listen, I'm sorry. I've got to go. I understand. Good. I was worried this was going to turn into a thing. You know, Jamie, Sarah, I'm not going to stick around and watch it happen to you two. You know the score. You're a smart kid. But... I thought you believed in me. I do. But give it enough time, and everyone's luck runs out. Listen, when the shit hits the fan, because it always does, remember that you can make it on your own. It's not an option for everyone. If things start heading south, don't let them drag you down with them. You don't owe them anything. They'll make you feel like you do. Like it's all one happy family. Oh, and push comes to shove. Yeah, I know. Good. Okay. You take care of yourself. I mean that. Here. Thanks. Yeah. I, uh... I gotta go. Hey, thought you'd be asleep by now. You okay? I'm fine. Okay, good. <laughs> Hell of a night, though. <sighs> the temperature's dropping. We're low on food. I think we gotta stay put for a while, you know, for Rebecca and the baby. So I'm thinking as soon as it gets light, Jane and I should go explore, see if we can find some place to scavenge. What? Jane left. For good. What? When? Just now. Are you serious? She didn't say anything about leaving to me? What the fuck? Damn it! Hey, keep it down. Sorry. I... Sorry. Just... Jane's gone. Really? Luke? Of all the childish bullshit... Childish? God damn it, Kenny, you know what, just lay off. No, you put our lives, this baby's life at risk, so you two could roll around like fucking teenagers. Look, I made a mistake, all right? No, it's not all right. 
What do you want from me? You guys are both acting like jerks. All you guys do is fight. Look, I'm sorry, okay? I fucked up. But you know what, Jane? She made an offer. And Jesus Christ, I needed it, okay? I mean, look around you, okay? Everything is shit. So forgive me for wanting to enjoy one moment of something else. Fine. But this baby, he's what matters now. Got it? So get your shit Jane, together. Where's my baby? Is everything all right? Everything is fine. We're gonna need a good place to race him, which ain't here. We gotta push on. We head north, get to Wellington. That's our best shot. There's a town across the river. It might be safe there. Or at least it might be a good stop on the way. Kenny! I'm sorry. Clem's got a point. That could be a whole town full of supplies, and not that far from here. A whole lot better than here, anyway. Looks like that's our best bet. We need to get on the road as soon as possible. We leave at first light. Whoa, whoa! What are you talking about? <coughs> Rebecca needs rest. A few days, at, at the least. We've got that baby formula. And it won't help the rest of us. And what about shelter? We'll freeze out here. Kenny's right. We should leave in the morning. Rebecca is not in any condition to travel. I'll be fine. If there's a chance there's food, we have to risk it. Okay, fine, if that's what you want. But we should all try to get some sleep. It's been a long day. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, Bex. It's gonna be all right. She's exhausted. We all are. I can keep going. We should have stayed put. We should have stayed put until she was in better shape. She wasn't gonna get no better back there. We gotta find food. Get her someplace warm. This look like someplace warm to you? We can still turn back. That's not an option. Everybody hang in there. We gotta keep moving if we're gonna make it to that town before nightfall. You don't even listen to anyone else. You just go on barking orders. You gotta lighten up, okay? You're pushing them too hard. I'm just doing what has to be done, like always. You're not helping anything by arguing. Don't forget, you agreed with me last night that we should get moving as quick as possible. Kenny, she said she doesn't want you to take the baby. Don't be weird about it, okay? I ain't being weird about it. Yeah, you kinda have been. And not just right now. Kenny knows what he's doing. He's been a dad before. That's not the part I was concerned about. Hello? What is this? Minas Lishna! Arvo? Arvo? Jane and I met him on the observation deck, before everyone else came. You know this son of a bitch? Well, what's he want? He doesn't look like much. That ain't the point. Hello? Please? He has a sick sister. They might be in trouble. Huh. All right. Hello. Your 
name is Clementine. Yes? Hi, Arvo. These are your friends? I'm hoping you can help me now, not like before. All of you can help. What do you need? How can we help? I need, uh, uh, things for... bandages. I need bandages. Are you... hurt? No. Nikaki Aruji! Nikaki Aruji! Nikaki Aruji! Fuck! Это они? Да. Это они. <laughs> Скажи им, чтобы они поставили их оружие на пол, и что мы забираем все, что они имеют. Что ты хочешь, чтобы я взял? Откуда я знаю? Чтобы у них не было. What did your friend say? I told them you are the ones who robbed me. They think it's funny that you're just a little girl. Robbed? And they want you and your friends to put down the guns, so we can take your things. Whoa, whoa, hang on now. What the hell? You might get excited. Clementine, you robbed this guy? No, you aren't taking anything from us. They're not telling me to ask. So what is Josh? I wish we could have met differently, Clementine. You were kind. That is not common. Watch it there, then. This can be easy for you. Arvo, скажи, чтобы они опустили оружие. All of you, just put your guns down. This will be fine. Find my ass! We have a baby! You have a baby with you? У них грудничковый ребенок! Если ты знаешь, что хорошо для тебя, просто не снимай оружие сейчас! И слишком много! Курико, отойди! Drop that now or I'm gonna fucking shoot it! I'll do it! No. Drop it! Drop it! Don't fucking... Don't move! I said don't move! They won't just umer yet. They won't just umer yet. You do my story, I'll rush you. This doesn't have to go down. Go, 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 go! Let's 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 go!